Israel, Kofi Blebo Pariazo is a young Ghanaian technologist who says he was inspired by Ghana's premier technologist, the great apostle Kojo Safo, whose invention ranges from household appliances like TV set to automobile and even airplane. Uh, the person who encouraged me most is Apostle Kojo Safo. Anytime I see his view on the television, I used to tell my friends that one day I will start doing all this thing. Israel started his own invention around 2007. But before then, he had to acquire some basic skills in the area of electrical, electronics and carpentry. Since he started, he has been able to create the following product. Okay, we have so many things that we do over here. We have electronics door, as you see it right here. This one is operated by a code over here. Without a code, you can't access to the door. So I'm going to operate it for you to see how it works. So this is a battery that operates also this door. So assuming still, if there is light or still, you can have a backup. We are going to activate the door right now to see how it works. So we are going to just enter into the code and see whether it will accept the code for us. So you see the handle open, then So as soon as you press star, then it means it cancel the whole code and it restart back again. It means closed. So when you are inside the room and you want to come out, there is no need for you to enter into any code. As soon as you just press to the short button, then it automatically open by itself. So we are going to try that one again and then we'll see. This is how it looks like itself yeah it means it's locked as soon as you force the handle to open i just want to tell you that that's how so you see it will be for you to give you a warning that it's not accepted you see you see this door according to him cost a thousand five hundred ghana cities and above next is the remote controlled light which cost 30 Ghana cities. So we are having our remote control switch over here that controls our bulbs in the room here. So as you can see this is a general bulb, any bulb you can use it. So we are going to operate this light by using this remotely control to operate it. So let's see, this is our remote control here then any button then this is how our light works. I'm going to operate it again to put it off. He also has among his collection a remote controlled curtain. We are having our Panasonic uh, flat screen remote control over here. That's we want to try to our remote curtains over here. So let's see how it operates. You just press any button and automatically it operates. So according to him. The curtain goes for 800 Ghana CDs. So this is how it works. You see the curtains open. This is how it is. It's done. So we are going to still control it by the remote control and then we'll see how it closed. So this is how our remote curtains works. uses 12 volts battery so if there's still light off still you have a reserve power to still um, operate your curtains and then the door too so we are having a home theater over here that controls by a clapping switch light as soon as you clap your hand then it's on as soon as you blow air on it then it becomes off this home theater over here uses pen drive. It's having FFM um, model. It's having also where you can place your computer or your mobile phone in so that you can still use your mobile phone to operate your music that you want to play. So we are going to try 
and then see how it works. So this is our system. So we are going to try two times. Right now I'm going to blow air on it and it's going to be off and I will see how it is for the next time. So our system is off. So we are going to clap our hand to make our system activated again. So two times hand clap then. So we have our control system over here. We are still on it. We are still on the construction. So this is our volume control. You see, this is our base control. So this is the surrounding. This is our surrounding. So this is our base control. So So this is another product that we are doing over here in Israel One Super Technology. We have our washing basin that uses a photo sensor. As soon as you apply your hand over here, then it come, the water come out automatically. Then you wash your hand. After washing your hand, you come into the next stage over here to dry your hand also. So this is also what we are doing in our company over here. A mosquito repellent over here that is made by Israel One Super Technology over here, made in Ghana here. So as soon as you plug it, this one there is no any chemical inset to this um, device over here. As soon as you plug it, it takes eight months before it expired. It's pure electronics. This one there is no smoke or there is no chemical that it will be affected by any child or anybody. It's pure electronics. The mosquito plant also going for almost um, 35 Ghana CD also. Over here too, we have our fridge guide and then the TV guide also. So this is a fridge guide. This one also can be used as a TV guide. So this is how it is. You see our name written on the front panel over here is run one super technology home appliances guide this is how it look like made in ghana here so we are going to test our device over here this is the fridge guide so we are going to see how the delay and then the activation or activate work so this is how it is as soon as you plug it it delays to regulate the voltage before it switch on your device for you so this is how it is you see the number of time that it delays so you see the green light over here it means it has been activated so anything that you plug over here will be working for you so this is how it works the fridge guide is also going for 35 um, Ghana CD talking about challenges he said I can say for now we need financial facilities we need people that will help us to grab this business because right now we are planning even to go to the rural areas to open more business over to help the youth over there so that's some of the challenges that's because right now what i'm doing i'm not taking loan from anywhere it's just my other business that i'm doing that is supporting me to come out of all what i'm doing asked if he is willing to share his knowledge he said anybody that is willing to have the knowledge even when you are, you, are, you are gifted with anything, I can help you to grow up with your knowledge. That's the main important thing that we do over here.